Hey, hello and welcome back again. Are you ready for this week? This week, we're going to have a special week, all right? And this class is going to be special as well. Why? Because look at this. It's amazing, it's wildlife. There are, there are animals, insects, trees, everything, plants, everything. So we're going to talk about the environment and how we can take care of it. And of course, because this is art, we're going to create something using our imagination, as always. All right? So, we can't lose this. This is part of our planet, and we can't lose it. So what can we do? We will see. You ready? Because I am. This is Mr. Chester, and this is art. All right, so here we are. So as I said before, we have a theme week and we're going to talk about how to take care of our planet, our environment, everything. And the main thing is this, organizations and people fighting for the care of our planet. All right, so before we start, there's something I need to tell you. It's the planet Earth, it's a beautiful, beautiful place to live in, right? Fortunately, we as humans are killing our planet and we're not the only ones who live here, you know? We have animals, um, plants, insects, we're not the only ones, all right? So the big issue is that we're killing their environment and their houses because animals live in the planet with us. And one of the biggest problems, the biggest issues, is that there is a lot of pollution through air, water and land, and that is very, very bad. Um, so it is important that we protect our planet with little actions, like recycling for instance, or do not leave the water running, or just, if you're not using lights, just turn them off, because that kills our planet. So, we need to try to do our best to help the world and his animals, his plants, everything, the nature in general. And for that, we have different organizations that take care of our planet. For example, I have 10 here. Greenpeace, World Wildlife Fund, WWF, Programa de las Naciones Unidas para el Medio Ambiente de PN. UMA, um, World Nature Organization, uh, the Nature Conservancy, Friends of Earth International, uh, Earth Action, Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, um, the Climate Group, and one more, the Climate uh, Reality Project. Okay, so all of these organizations help the environment, help the planet um, to be a better place. All right because there are a lot of animals that are endangered in peligro de extinción and not just animals, plants, insects so that's no good I love animals and it's, it is very sad what's happening so question now that we know that these organizations help the animals, help the environment, the planet, etc what do they have in common? they have something in common of course, they help the planet, but there is something else. Look at this one. What are these? The Climate Change Reality Project, WWF, Friends of Earth, etc. What are these things? These are logos or symbols, whatever you want to call it. Alright, so this is going to be fun. Alright, so what are we going to do now? We're going to create our own logo, emblem or sim symbol, right? And the important thing is that it needs a drawing and a phrase, a word or a name. For example, here we have the WWF. As you can see, that's their logo, the panda and the letters that mean something. You can change this, alright? You can use your imagination and create your own. And 
as always, I did mine. This is what I did. This is what I did last night and it's called my planet, my friend. So you can see here, these are trees. This is our planet, it's happy, full of colors. My planet, our planet, and it's also my friend. We have to treat it like a friend. And there you can see on top of the planet, there is a fox, a panda, and a koala. The fox in the middle is like one of the foxes that we have in Chile and is endangered, right? And um, the, the koala is endangered and the panda is endangered. So we need to take care of these animals and the planet in general, all right? So if you don't believe me, I did this. Here I have it, all right? So this is what I did. Can you see it? It is very nice. It was very simple. I just used my imagination. I said, hmm, what can I create? My planet, how can I help it? My planet is my friend. So that's how I created it. And I did this, look, it moves. Can you see? Because the planet moves. So I just did what I always do. I used my imagination. And that's the final result. See? It's like the animals were behind. So this is what we're going to do. This is what you have to do now. You're going to create your own logo, helping the environment. It's going to be very fun, I promise. All right? So that's it. Very simple. Enjoy this week. It's going to be very relaxing for all of you. And now, because I promised, I'm going to show you some of the pieces of art that you have sent to me so far. All right? I have a lot, but focus on this week. All right? Let's take care of our planet, our environment. I need you to do it. I do it all the time. All right? I don't want to lose it. So let's do it. All right? So, because I promised, as I said, let's go and see some of your pieces of art. I hope you enjoy this. Um, I hope you had enjoyed this class. I hope you can send me this project. I would love to see it. All right? So now, what did I use? I used like cereal cardboard, like very easy. Um, you can use, if you want this, um, cartulina, um, whatever you want. And um, I painted it, painted it with, um, with this, just normal pencil, uh, crayons, you can use tempera if you want to, um, what else? Whatever you want, it's your decision, all right? So use your imagination, try to use little things, something you have at home, all right? So you don't get complicated. That's it, very easy. Now, it's time to go. I'm Mr. Chester and this is Art. Bye. Wait, wait, wait. I forgot. Se me olvidó, como siempre. Lo que vamos a hacer, toda esta semana vamos a estar hablando de nuestro medio ambiente. ¿Ya? En diferentes eh, asignaturas, en todas las asignaturas. Vamos a crear en arte nuestro propio logo. ¿Ya? Vamos a diseñar un logo de cómo podemos demostrar cuidar el medio ambiente. ¿Qué podemos hacer? ¿Podemos hacer un cambio? ¿Podemos generarlo? ¿Podemos ayudar realmente al medio ambiente? Esto quizás pueda servir en el futuro, no lo sabemos. Pero es algo que para mí es muy significativo. Como les decía, tratemos de cuidar el medio ambiente, no dejemos el agua corriendo de las llaves, apaguemos las luces si no las necesitamos. Yo sé que hace mucho frío, pero hay que tratar de usar lo necesario. Si podemos reciclar, genial. De a poco vamos a ir ayudando al medio ambiente como lo hacen todas las organizaciones que vimos el día de hoy. ¿Ya? Así que, concéntrese, vamos por el logo, quiero verlo, envíenlo al correo que les dejé en el Word. Y muchas gracias por todos los um, projects, uh, pieces of art, todas las piezas de arte que me han enviado. Recuerden usar lo que ustedes quieran, pueden usar temperas, lápiz crypto, um, eh, lápiz de palo, lo que ustedes quieran. Y yo, como les decía, usé el, la caja de un cereal para recortar esto. Pueden usar eh, cabo, eh, ¿cómo se llama esta cosa? Eh, cartón. Usen su imaginación. 
Si van a usar cartulina, también sirve, etc. ¿Ok? Ahora sí me despido. Soy Mr. Chester, and this is art. Bye.